a university that produces 47 All-Americans, a National Player of the Year, a National Freshman of the Year, a U.S. Amateur Champion, three Public Links Champions, four Walker Cup participants, and eight Palmer Cup representatives, along with three former Rebels that went on to represent the U.S. in the Ryder Cup, have to give credit to a person who bred all of these amazing golfers. Meet Dwayne Knight, one of the most successful college golf coaches in the history of the sport, leading the Rebels to success since the fall of 1987 in his 33rd season now as the leader of the UNLV men's golf program. His list of accomplishments goes on, most notably leading the Rebels to a team national title in 1988. Let's get to know a little more about where he comes from. An accomplished golfer on his own, Knight played four seasons at New Mexico, 1966 through 69, and played in the 1967 team that won the WAC championship and placed ninth at nationals. Knight then spent five years, 1972 to 77, on the PGA Tour, winning his first tournament, the Southwest PGA Championship, as early as his second season. After leaving the tour, Knight replaced Dick McGuire as New Mexico's head coach in 1978. Knight remains a member of the Professional Golfers Association. Coach Knight's been here for 34 years, I think, something like that, and uh, he's led a lot of teams, won one of our school's national championships, one of our two, uh, basketball and golf are the only two that have one as a team. Um, but so his just kind of Hall of Fame status was definitely a big draw. Um, the program's success, and the year before I got here, we made match play, which is really cool, and we had made nationals uh, like four years in a row I think had one conference uh two years prior to me getting here and then we won my freshman year um so just, there's a lot of a lot of success in our program uh this happened to be when we won the tournament uh on front page of the sports here in Las Vegas as if being a legendary coach wasn't enough coach Knight has spent time in the Las Vegas community by being active in charitable efforts benefiting the Nevada Childhood Cancer Foundation and The Caring Place, a program dedicated to easing the journey of adults diagnosed with cancer as well as their caregivers. Everybody is speaking of Coach Knight and his amazing career, but what does he think about it? In an interview about his time at UNLV, Coach Knight said, I'm very proud of what we have accomplished here at UNLV in my time. I can remember the first time we qualified for nationals in 1989 and how excited we were just to make it there. Now I feel like we have moved to the next level where our players expect to go to nationals and are ready to compete for the national championship every year. Coach Knight has been appraised as one of the all-time greats and we are so happy to call him a rebel for life.